Now, if I steal all the sweet rolls, everyone's gonna know the sweet roll bandit's back, and I kind of. Oh God! I should not take the sweet rolls. That's gonna ruin the plan. Okay. So yeah. Anyway, so I didn't manage to uh, to do one of the tasks. Why are you looking kind of annoyed with me? Have you run out of sweet rolls or something? Because if if so, um, well, I may have some more bad news. I don't suppose you've got I any. Don't like it here. Neither do I. Nobody likes it, and it's Windhelm. But you're the one that said it was a bloody emergency. I don't have an ethical problem with violence, quite the contrary, really. It's just uh, I prefer to be on the giving side of the equation rather than the receiving side. So the whole face-to-face -face combat just does not interest me. I mean, for a start, it's dangerous. It's unbelievably messy, usually involving various body fluids flying around from various different people. And let's face it. It's usually a sign that something has gone wrong. All the planning has gone to hell and now I'm in trouble. So honestly, yeah, I'd, I'd much prefer it if we could just get on with the jobs and the violence was a one-way thing. I mean, don't, don't you sometimes wish we could just go in, get things done, not have to end up screaming and drinking healing potions? Fighting is one of the few things I am good at, but yes, sometimes I wish my talent was not so necessary. I do enjoy the feeling of serene focus that descends during battle, though. For a while, all other thoughts are absent, and I just... am. Unless I am being attacked by a horrid monstrosity, that is. Well, I that's wish it were not so, pretty but normal. I cannot remain composed around certain enemies. Battle is less enjoyable when my mind is fighting fear. Uh, there is no bravery without fear. You can't be in a go the brave mode. There is no bravery without fear. Is there bravery without disgust? Because usually when we're in combat, my feelings are mild irritation with extreme ooh. There is no bravery without fear. Wise words. Many people seem confused by that idea, but I agree with you. Standing up to what scares us is true bravery. We are all courageous in our own way. We... If someone says they are not frightened by anything, they may lack imagination. Anyway, I do enjoy fighting for the most part. There is nothing like the rush of beating a powerful opponent. After a tough battle, I feel more alive than ever. How about you? After a tough battle, if I feel alive, I'm generally satisfied. I mean, don't get me wrong. I enjoy the feeling of making a good kill. Sort of outsmarting and out, you know, maneuvering an opponent. There, there is something very satisfying about that. But the whole hack slash scream thing. No, not really. Not really me. Not my thing, I'm afraid. I understand. It is a shame you have to do battle when your heart is not in it. You fight a good fight, though. Hmm. Maybe it is your aversion to combat that makes you so capable. You get the job done with no silly messing around. That is to be applauded. Uh. We have many more battles to win, my friend. That is true whether we like it or not. I may not enjoy every fight, but if our time together has taught me anything, it is that every fight by your side is worth it. Okay. That's that's nice. Can we can we go back to the bit where you said no silly messing around? Are you mocking me? I just can't always tell with you. So we managed to avoid catastrophe and acquire some more sweet rolls for Inigo here, but we had to travel to the nearest city, which unfortunately was Windhelm. Luckily, I did have three tasks here for the Thieves Guild, so that gave us something to do, 
something to uh, spend a little time and distract ourselves from the horror that is Windhelm. And it also means that there was the occasional sighting of the Sweet Roll Bandit here, which hopefully should further help the, um, the ruse that the recent crime spree in Riften had nothing to do with us. So now, the day has waned on a little, now the Jarl should have received lots of reports of various criminal activities and be thinking, how can I put a stop to this and we shall turn up with a solution. Yes, we shall. Now we're going to take the I've got no problem with carriage. That stronghold they've got in the that does not look very safe, does it, really, when you think about it? I actually talked to some of the local merchants about quarried stone because... Did that guard just... Give me a location. Something about orcs. Apparently it lodged itself in my memory. Yeah, I asked the local merchants about quarried stone because I thought if any city knows about stone, it's Windelm because that's pretty much all they possess. They're almost as bad as Markarth in that respect. But I was told that, you know, people don't really buy and sell quarried stone because there are places dotted all over the place where you can just dig it up. And apparently the people whose land that stone is on don't mind if you just wander in there and take what you want, which does seem rather stupid. It's probably a Nord thing, because honestly, my first thought was we should buy all of the locations and start charging for access. Either that, or we should uh, come to some sort of agreement and uh, say, we'll take half of anything you dig up, because we do need some. Hello. Need a ride? Yes, I do. My carriage is the safest way to travel. We're heading back. Where do you want to, to go? To Riften. Okay, Jarl. As Jarl Leila's house car, I would ask that you maintain a respectable distance from her at all times. What is a respectable distance? And thank you for reminding me of her name. Jarl, is this respectable? Y'all, Lila, I've heard terrible news that Riften is having a crime spree, and I came as soon as I could to offer my assistance. Welcome to Riften, traveler. I hope the road fared well for you. It, 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 was, it was a little rough, but I, I, I soldiered through it to get here as soon as possible. I have news for you, though. I believe your recent crime spree is linked to the skooma problem. You know what people are like when they get... Uh, the urges and suddenly get cantankerous and demand they need their fix. They do something stupid like stealing valuables or heading to Windhelm. I happen to know the key skooma dealer in Riften. Yes, I'm afraid we're aware of Sarthus's presence in the warehouse. Unfortunately, we're oh. certain he has informants within the city guard. Every time we've made a move to arrest him, he's escaped. However, if you take care of this discreetly, you might be able to surprise him without warning. Um, okay. No, of course I'll do it. But, but what exactly do you mean? I mean, do you want me to arrest him? Excellent. Here, this is the key to the warehouse. See if you can drop in on this dealer of poison and convince him to close down his operation permanently. You want me to have a... Ch is this Is this one of those subtle hints? Convince him to shut it down. Be discreet. B uh, Good journey to you. I can be discreet. Okay, let's go. Did you have some sort of official business here? <sighs> that armor does not suit you. It's good armor. But I it request that when speaking to Yar Leila, you show the proper respect. Doesn't suit you. And it's not a problem with the armor, it's a problem with you. The armor's fine, it's your head that's the problem. You have the wrong face, the wrong hair, the wrong everything. Why do I get a... I've been looking for you. 
Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see. I have like ordered got to go. anything. I picked up all the nails and I've never got round to doing the whole enchanting thing. So... Eorl and Greymane, of, of course, yes. I left the ghost blade with him. He's going to temper it for me, although God knows how you temper a ghost blade. Apparently the man's a genius and he required, I think it was ectoplasm. You know, the more I think about it, the more I don't want to know. Okay, the warehouse was in this direction. We're supposed to be discreet. Not let them know we're coming. Maybe I should go at night. But you know, I'm I'm a, I'm a local businessman. I'm just going to wander around the docks. It was okay. That was Bolly's place, wasn't it? I think it was. Oh, it's the naughty lady. You're. Yeah, you're Maul, aren't you? What are Dirge you... Dirge told me you made it into the guild. You need dirt on anything, you talk to me. Um, yeah. Tell me more about the Blackbriars. Well, you got Maven. She pretty much runs the whole operation. She's got friends in high places, if you know what I mean. She's also got ties to the Dark Brotherhood and the Thieves' Guild. So basically, no one can touch her. Just remember, if she tells you to do something... You damn well better do exactly what she says. She's got ties with the Thieves Guild and the Brotherhood, so I should... Well, yes, well, I will I will definitely watch myself then. I mean, I wouldn't Slip want... Slip up and I'll gut you like a fish. I could have left it. I could have put it back. Ignore the man, he's unimportant. Ignore the man, he's unimportant. She's got friends in the Thieves Guild and the Dark Brotherhood. I am the Thieves Guild and the Dark Brotherhood. I don't like him. No, I don't. I think this is the place. Riften Warehouse. Why does the Jarl have a key to this warehouse? Is... Okay, we're supposed to be being discreet. Are you a guard? For the... I don't think... Are you snarling at me? I really don't like him. No, I don't. Okay. I wonder if Maven would object too much if he, you know, died. I'm hungry. Give me a second. Um, I've not seen anyone come or go. Honestly, I think I just need to sneak in there and see what is going on. I'm going to... I'm going to leave you here. If there's trouble, come get me. No guards around. I mean, I'm on official business anyway, so I suppose it really shouldn't matter. I mean, I've got a key. I just don't want to necessarily announce my present. Oh, that's bad. Where are you? Huh? Okay. Uh... So much for Sunday. Oh, there you okay, are. Okay, okay. Who, who's who's? I'll gut you like a horker. Probably. Oh, that's the best you can do. Ah! What do you mean? Is it the best I can do? There might be more. Okay. That did not. That's not exactly what I would call discreet. Although... It does seem... Like I've dealt with the issue. I, I guess... It requires a key. I mean, she said... Shut them down. I'm not sure if she meant... You know, well, she did say convince them to leave and they would like to arrest them. You're under arrest. 
Anything you say will scare the hell out of me because you're dead. Okay? Do you have anything on you? Oranai Dral? Sathris Idrun. This was the main... Ooh, Dwarven Sword. I think I've already got one of those. Steel arm, I can't remember if we need. Key. That will probably be for the door downstairs. Let's just check around for other things. I mean, really, what sort of warehouse is this? They've got more cobwebs than they've got stuff. They've got a little hay. A few items of food. And I do mean a few items of food. And skooman. Now, obviously, this is what the warehouse was being used for. All right, I'm not. South is such. Shipments ready. That is almost certainly what I am looking for. But yeah, you know, I mean, if, if you're going to have a warehouse where you're doing your illicit business from, the idea is you have some non-illicit business as a cover. This is a terrible cover. Yes, it is. Is it, is it me, or do the criminals in Skyrim seem rather stupid? I mean, I suppose that's probably good for me. It's just a little disappointing. Yes, it is. Shipments ready. Sarthis, just got a shipment of moon sugar from Morrowind. We're refining it now, and the skooma should be ready by the time you get to Crags Lane Cavern. Bring the gold or don't show up at all. Crags Lane Cavern. Where the hell is that? Okay, Crags Lane Cavern. He doesn't sound... Well, it doesn't sound very cavernish, actually. Crags Lane. It, it sounds like an address. Sort of place you find, I don't know, the butcher or something. Okay. Lead the way. We have a... Everything all right? Did someone say stop? Oh, it's the loony. We have, um... Arrested? The drug dealer? The problem should be probably not over until we visited the cavern. That is almost certainly what is going to happen next, isn't it? I'm going to go in there and say, good news, I've shut the operation down. And she's going to say, ah, but we best make sh best make sure. Can you possibly run off to the cavern and uh, make sure everyone's very, very dead? I'd send all of these guards I've got, but I just can't spare any. Want to take bets? Okay. Think charming. Charming and helpful. Okay. Hello? Did we have an appointment? No. Oh, no, she's not. It was a delivery? I can't remember. You're an enchantress, aren't you? It, it... It really probably isn't a good sign when you can't remember anything. Um, hello, Yarl Lila. What can I do for you? Um, Sarthis Idran has been taken it's care of. It's nice to receive good role. news for a change. Did you recover anything else from the warehouse worth mentioning? I would never uh, know. yes. I have found a lead. Then there's no time to lose. It won't take long for Sarthis's associates to learn of his death. The source of the poison must be destroyed once and for all. Otherwise, another dealer will simply take his place. Do this task for me, and you'll be well on your way to a title in Riften. It will be done! It will absolutely... Good. back to me when your task is complete. Excellent. Search the northeastern region of the rift for Crags Lane Cavern and find the scuba dealers within it. Journey to you. A title. She mentioned Excuse the title. Excuse my but I'm in the middle of some delicate experiments. That's that's nice. She mentioned a title in a go. This is looking good. Yes, it is. I tell you what. Let's just call in. 
Do, do you think we should possibly have a night's sleep? She did say I needed to hurry. But it is... It does look n like night is falling. I'm probably going to be tired soon. You know what? Let's prepare before we head out. So Crags Lane Cave is close to Ansilvund. That could work in my favour because there is an alchemy bench right outside there. I can use it before I head in here and take a night vision potion, which will be incredibly useful. I've only got one. Now, it's the middle of the night, early morning. I, I've had some sleep, but I decided I, was, I wanted to travel and arrive here while darkness was still here. So I'm trying to decide, do I want to go the same way I went before, down the mountain, there's all sorts of animals and things. Or do I just want to stay on the road, go past Fort Greenwall, through Shaw's Stone, and then round this squiggly bit? And then back up. I think I'm going to do that. I think I'm going to stick to the road. It is dark. I still have night vision from the last potion I took. And it, this seems to be because I don't lose the effects of potions while I sleep. It's as though when I sleep, my metabolism slows down and uh, the potion remains in my bloodstream, which is rather useful. But it won't be around for much longer, so I sh This is the fork. Okay, Fort Greenwall. This is Fort Greenwall, yes? Okay, this does not... Are these people friendly? I mean, this does not look friendly, does it? This looks like they don't want people... Okay, is this a... Okay, nobody screamed at us, but this does look a little... Why are they blocking the road? I mean, this is the main road from Windhelm to Riften, which is odd. I've never ridden down here personally. I've always taken a carriage. Does the carriage normally go this way, then? I would have thought this is the main road. And they've blocked it. And I have a feeling they might be bandits. Don't ask me how I have that feeling, but I just do. The thing is, they didn't scream, Oi, you! Give us your money! Which is very unbandit-like. So maybe they're... I don't... This just seems a very, very odd thing for... there to be on the main road. I wonder if there's an agreement with the guards. I mean, here's a, here's a guard in Shaw's Stone. Which has a blacksmith. And... Oh, excuse me. Not a lot else. All right. Well, that's a bit of a mystery, isn't it? A bandit fort that's blocking the road... But the bandits don't attack you, and none of the guards seem to be all that bothered by them. But they have blocked the road to some extent. There's no carriage. This is just a standard watchtower, right? Uh. There is a, a rift and guard here. There's a little side of me saying this is none of our business. And there is another side of me saying this is someone else's business. 
but could I benefit from it? Okay. Amulet of Talos? Um, it's not that valuable. No, it's not. I don't need the arrows. I don't think you need the arrows. Maybe, maybe you do. I haven't checked your arrow situation in a while. Alto wine. Mm. What is going on here? Right. Is someone about to attack Riften? There is blood everywhere. There is... Letter to Akar. Akar. We've word of a band of Legion soldiers advancing on your position. Reinforcements are on the way. Talos guard you. The true sons and daughters of Skyrim. Oh. Okay. Are you guys sort of with the storm cloaks and the Empire is planning an attack? I'm hungry. Okay, well, well, this just isn't my problem, I guess. It's just piqued my curiosity, which is mildly annoying. Yes, it is. I'm actually wondering whether this outfit is the correct outfit for what we're going to do. We're, we're, we're trying to find a cavern, infiltrate it, and uh, let's face it arrest the people we find there and destroy any production facilities? And by arrest I mean stab. Or poison. I'd prefer to poison, if possible. I think this is the path. Maybe we should go on foot from here. It doesn't look particularly Spider. I'm hearing a spider. That's your cue. Have fun. Go get the spider. Oh, of course you're waiting for me to attack, because I told you to wait for me to attack. <sighs> okay. You'd think I'd be less creeped out by spiders, really. They creep around and they poison things. <sighs> that should probably give me a moment of introspection. A sort of epiphany. A reflection on the direction of taking my life. Well, it doesn't. All right, now... This does not look much like a road, but I'm pretty sure it is. So I'm looking for Ansilvund, and I'm also looking for a cavern. I want to find them in that order. That looks like Ansilvund, which would make the... Oh, excuse me. Which would make... Right, the cavern should be over in that direction. Did we miss a turning? Probably. We can worry about that in a while. For now, let's get up to Ansilvund and use the alchemy bench. I am not... I see a fire. Could that be the cavern we're supposed to be heading to? Right, Anselvund is there. Okay. I have a feeling that is where we're going. Yes, I see somebody. 
Right. Let us get to Anselvund. And, uh... Check there's nobody there. We did kill everybody the last time we were here, but, you know, you never know. Someone might have come. Am I... Did I hear something else over there? Yeah, I'm also going to change. I want to change into the Nightingale gear. It is a little um, more appropriate for what I have in mind. I'm wearing a mask, a cape, and dark leather. And I'm travelling with my trusty sidekick on my way to fight evildoers. You couldn't make this sort of thing up, could you, really? It's about as ridiculous an idea as I've ever heard. But for some reason, I, I sort of feel like I need a new name. I mean, the Sweet Roll Bandit is... a different persona. I am some sort of dark, avenging hero. I mean, we already had the the moment with the spider, but Spider-Man sounds so silly. Who would want to call themselves something like Spider-Man? Spider-Bite? That's a little... No, that sounds like a drink. The Black Widow? The Black Widower! That could work. The Black Widower and... The Blue Furball? No, that, 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 that's really not going to work. You know what? Doesn't matter. Right. I have the correct attire. I have got night vision for a while. For, I have no idea where. Oh, Blessing of Talos. Right, yes. Night eye. I even have a few resists and improvements to things like sneak. I should probably get on with it. We've only got about ten minutes. Oh, the Black Widower needs to poison. I was thinking this. Target moves at 50% speed for 184 seconds, damages the target's health by 184 points, and they become weaker to the next blow. Oh, I like that. That is a good... Oh, look at this. Onwards! Furball? Fuzzball? Yeah, no, in a go. You, 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 yeah, no, let's just, let's just, let's not be stupid, and let's also get our heads in the right frame of mind. That frame of mind being, let's go and murder everybody over there. Was it over there? No, I think it was more over there. Stay here. Come back safe. Oh, it is dark. Perfect. What do we have here? We have what sound like wolves. And at least one guard. decided to. Okay, so that guard is just walking up and down there. But I'm hearing wolves or dogs. Oh god, there's dogs. Those are... Oh no, those are in ca They're in cages. Okay, I've got to remember it's very dark and he can't see me. Or hear me, because I've got muffled. Oh, he's going to see me if I do that. I am muffled. Ooh. 
All right. I was going to poison him, but he looked like he was about to turn around. You're in a cage, and you're going to stay in a cage. Yes, you are. Out of curiosity, though, am I in the right place? Cracks Lane, Kevin, okay, I'm in the right place. Yeah, we're just going to leave. Oh, we're going to kill him. That's the other option. We're just going to we're just going to kill the wolves. Are they wolves? Are they dogs? We're just going to kill them because, right? Just because. <sighs> well, might as well get the eyes. Oh, God. Might as well get the eyes from them. Sometimes, Inigo, you are surprisingly vicious. Pitwolf. I suppose you could probably argue it was an act of mercy. I got... Uh, okay. Never mind. I suppose it was an act of mercy because there was no way in hell I was letting them out. And they probably would have starved to death. Why do they have... Pit wolves? Oh, good grief. I have a feeling we are going to find more than just drugs in Crags Lane Cavern. Okay. Disrupt the skooma operation within Crags Lane Cavern. All right. And by disrupt, I assume it means kill everybody. What do you need? Uh, a reassurance that the kill everyone plan is the correct one, but I'm... Um, I will be here when you return. You know, I'm sort of new to this working for a Jarl thing. I mean, Jarls are all into the kill their enemies, aren't they? Execute criminals. That's normal, isn't it? I'm going to get back. It's going to be... No, I meant smash the distillery. Don't butcher everybody in existence. Well, then you should have sent a guard. And not the Black Widower. How am I going to get past this guy? I mean, I'm sneaky, but... Stay there. Here we go. Wizards. Now that's. You were about to say something, were you? Well, I'm not that interested. Right. Please, please tell me. This will kill you. Also. Give me your money. Oh, what? Really? Really? Okay, well, it was enough, but only just right. So. Okay, so we have pit fights going on here, do we? And apparently only one. Now, how dark is it? Can I... Oh. Okay. 
uh, frenzy. And uh, did you have anything? Is someone there? No, no, go, for, go for your friends. I should be invisible again. I am. Go for your friends. Attack your friend. Kill your friend. Oh my God, friends. Did you hear something? Wait. What? What the? Hell? Why aren't they? Okay. Mm. Nothing here after all. Okay. I was never gonna get a poison in her. Okay. Um. These people don't actually look awfully bandit-like. Okay. Barky! Um... Not... I don't think anyone's gonna miss these people. No, I don't. Crags Lane chest key. Um, I want to know why the frenzy isn't working. Cause they're too tough, probably. <sighs> Slightly annoying, but all right. Oh my! <coughs> my invisibility is done. How dark is it? It's pretty dark. It's pretty dark. Ooh, stuff. Uh, mm. so you won't worry about. The Wolf Queen Volume 1. I need that one. I need that one. Oh, nice. Now that's the real arc. All right. No rough stuff. Okay. Take it and go. Right, how dark is it here? Is you are you is your friend gonna see me if I And what is through there? Gonna start keeping a knife. Alright, you know what? Let's just keep doing what you're doing. It's working. He didn't see. Oh, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Top. And... No! Nice. And it doesn't seem like the, the wolf cares. So, I see Skooma. I don't see a lot else. Cages, cages. See anyone else? Okay. Butcher. Crags Lane dog cage key. Okay. Oh my. Uh. Curiosity. Oh. Would you guys finish him off for me? Oh. Okay. Apparently, yes. X O. Okay, you found me, haven't you? You found... Nope. 
Yeah. That was the downside of the plan, really, wasn't it? Use wolves to kill him. Have to uh, face wolves. But to be honest, there's a side of me wanting the eye of the wolf. Was there anyone else? Oh, is this the last? Yeah. Unfortunately, can't pickpocket a wolf. Nowhere to stick the poison. And now that I said that out loud, I'm just imagining. And really wishing that I wasn't. <laughs> 